Hi, um, it's Molly. I haven't really posted in a while, um, so I thought I'd make this. This is kind of a story that a lot of people from school, I don't know if anyone watches me from school, but um, my entire seventh grade year, I had a lot of troubles at school. Um, I was in school for about a month. And then I kind of started skipping classes and going home and people asked me why and I kind of just told them because I feel like it because I didn't want to go. Um, well, the real reason for everything that I've done during 7th and 8th grade, leaving class, having my phone out, stuff like that, um, I have anxiety which I understand a lot of people don't know about. Anxiety is like a panic disorder. And we don't really know why it happens and we don't, we can't really predict it. Um, I'm on medication for it. I take medication every morning um, so I can go to school and try and live normally. Um, but some days I have really hard days and I just can't stay at school. Well, during seventh grade, I left for three months. And that entire time I was having panic attack I was having panic attacks. I would isolate myself. I've never, ever been suicidal. Yes, I am depressed, but I have never been suicidal. I don't cut, I don't do anything, this isn't one of those videos. But I'm making this video to try and help people. I know someone in our school who um, has the same problem that I do. And I've recently got really close to her through tennis. And um, so I guess I'm just making this video for anyone who's going through the same thing I am. Um, whenever I left school, I stayed home. I tried homeschooling. There was a major risk that I was going to be taken away from my family. And that really scared me. That caused more panic attacks than what I normally had. And so I got into um, homeschooling. And I really didn't learn anything there. I didn't even finish the standardized testing to see where I'm at. I just basically I locked myself in my room for three months and my parents would come in my room I would go into the closet and I would lock myself in the closet um, but I'm kind of trying to clear things up a lot of people think I'm really really small I'm bony I basically don't look healthy but and everyone thinks that I'm anorexic which I'm really not I'm not anorexic I'm not bulimic I'm so against that I'm I want to help anyone that does I have a friend that does and I'm trying to get her help I'm not bulimic or anorexic I I actually heard this rumor from school that I had died of bulimia so that kind of hurt um and then there were others really dumb ones like i got pregnant or stuff like that which none of that really happened i basically seventh grade was basically just my living hell that's just how it was and it's hard because people will judge you if they find out about this no, I'm not going to put this on Facebook. I'll let people find it, find them it's, find this it, themselves if they want to see it. But I'm basically just kind of here to talk. If anyone who sees this video has anxiety or an eating disorder or depression or they're suicidal or they cut themselves, you can talk to me. Um 
I kind of understand how that feels. Now, I've already explained I'm, I don't have an eating disorder, I'm not suicidal, but I have all kinds of friends. A ton of my friends are like, have a lot of problems like I do. And we get judged a lot, and it just makes it worse. So, if something ever weird happens to kids in, our, in your school, don't make up rumors. Don't put them down. They're already having a hard time, don't make it worse. So.